Hi, hello, welcome. We are at what is colloquially known as Astro Park as Astro Park, but it is officially known as the Trusco Bank Allo Hockey Park. So if you are from Ventuk Gymnasium, you are an alumnus, alumni of Ventuk Gymnasium, you might know it as the Astro. So this evening we are looking forward to what is promising to be a tough game between the Ventuk Gymnasium and Ventuk High School first girls team, first girls teams, my apologies. Um, Ages ranging between 16 and 18, meaning that these players are currently in their prime. They've had just enough time for training and they're just young enough that their knees aren't crackling yet. <laughs> so after this, we are bringing you the high school first boys team. But for now, we will be bringing you an interview with the Ventuk Gymnasium and Ventuk High School team captains. Okay. So we are at the annual Inter High, and this is a somewhat friendly interaction between the schools of Ventuk High School and Ventuk Gymnasium. And we are currently looking at Astro Park under the sunlight, but if you're joining us for the game, you will see a lovely array of colors, spectrum of colors, watching the sunset with us. Annual Inter High is, as I've mentioned, an annual tradition between Ventuk High School and Ventuk Gymnasium, where the two schools come together, show off their pride in a number of sports codes, a number of events ranging from intellectual events, chess, all types of things. But let's go over to the team captains. So you're showing the game? Or are you showing that? So that's all you're showing. So is it team captain? to a wonderful game here on the Ventuk Gymnasium team. Number one, Minka Collard. Number two, Ni uh, Nika Ludwig. Number three, Landry Krier. Number four, Dan uh, Danika Griev. Number five, Hailey Skikkerling, who is also the captain. Number six, Renee Rija, who is the vice captain. Number seven, Nicola Ferri. Number eight, Kyla Landsberg. Number nine, Mbirika Gunga. Number 10, Annika Higgs. Number 11, Kiara Witt. Number 12, Anya Rabi. Number 13, Aniki Raal. Number 14, Karen Lofty Eaton. Number 5, Oni Kennedy. Number, uh, number 16, apologies. Number 16, Andrea Rakao. Coaches, Renelle Sneeman and Bianca Rieder. And the management of Yvonne Van Holtz at play there. On the Ventuk High School side, number one, Jamie Henker, playing as the captain and also the goalie, a girl of many talents. Number two, Caitlin Left. Number three, Kiana Kraus, who's the vice captain. Number four, Kayla Swart. Num number five, Caitlin Kutzer. Number six, Diana, uh, Daniela van Koller. Number seven, Helindi Vett. Third time's a charm. We are still in the second quarter of Ventuk High School versus Ventuk Gymnasium's first girls teams. We have seen some beautiful play between the two teams up to now. Uh, apologies, we have had some serious technical difficulties this evening. Um, we all know that technology is great until it isn't anymore. But. Again, I am a firm believer that third time's a charm. Let's see if we can get it right on lucky number three. Ventuk High School plays off and they play backwards just a little before they make a long shot forward. Ventuk High School keeping possession of the ball there, but the Khamis seem very, very eager for, the, uh, for that ball possession. Ventuk Gymnasium intercepts. Very nice flick again from Ventuk Gymnasium. Ventuk Gymnasium misses that intercept. Ventuk Gymnasium takes possession of the ball. Ventuk Gymnasium keeps possession of the ball. 
ball out of bounds. Pantuk Gymnasium plays off. Oh, referee calls him back. Pantuk Gymnasium plays off. Pantuk High School intercepts and they're really seemingly looking to widen that gap. Pantuk High School still keeping possession of the ball. Let's see if they can make it past that last chemi. Pantuk Gymnasium believes otherwise. Referee sends game play back. We are still tied at zero each. Let's see if the second quarter will be either of these teams' opportunity to make a dent on that scoreboard. And Ventuk High School plays off. Nice long shot there from Ventuk High School. Ventuk High School number two plays back, but is intercepted by Ventuk Gymnasium. Ventuk Gymnasium playing forward in a swarm of blue. Ventuk High School intercepts. And they carry it forward. Mantuk Gymnasium takes possession of the ball. Mantuk High School in possession of the ball. And Khami shoots and she, well, doesn't score, but she definitely gets what she wants in that playoff. But the high school takes possession of the ball once again, but the gymnasium intercepts again a beautiful flick and the referee calls gameplay back. Shoot off there from Ventuk High School, number five. Ventuk High School playing backward. Gymnasium attacks and they score the ball. Bantuk Gymnasium playing back around to see if they can keep the ball in their possession and they can. Bantuk High School tries to intercept and fails. Ooh, we're close, we're close. And the ball gets sent back into the pitch. Bantuk High School gains possession of the ball. Let's see if they can keep it. Ball out of bounds, Gymnasium throws off. Gymnasium sends the ball into their territory. Gymnasium plays it forward. Ooh, beautiful. <laughs> well, I don't want to say a beautiful miss, but a beautiful miss there from the Duke High School. And Bantuk Gymnasium catches that flick. I think the only thing more beautiful than their flicks is when they catch their flicks. It's crazy. I never would have gotten that. <laughs> that is a powerful shot. And Bantuk Gymnasium trying to keep off the defense of Bantuk High School. Let's see if they can succeed. Bantuk High School intercepts. And they have nowhere to go with their interception. Bantuk Gymnasium playoff there from the sidelines. Ventuk Gymnasium plays off. Ventuk Gymnasium number 12 takes possession. That girl has power. Ventuk High School currently in possession of the ball and playing it forward until Ventuk Gymnasium intercepts. That is Ventuk Gymnasium trying to carry the ball forward um, through a, cr a crowd of players there. Very close miss there from Ventuk High School number 12. And a playoff for the ball. Bantuk Gymnasium intercepts and the referee halts the game. Player from Bantuk Gymnasium. Ooh. Bantuk High School fights hard for that ball. And 
and the referee has spoken. And the high school takes possession of the ball. And they are keeping with these long shots that are working out for them. That was a beautiful shot, guys. Number 13 for Ventuk High School takes possession of the ball. And Ventuk High School somehow manages to keep their long strides until Ventuk Gymnasium intercepts. We're currently moving into Gymnasium country, Gymnasium territory until Ventuk High School intercepts. Let's see if they can keep it in their possession. to high school chases that ball and they catch it went to high school carrying the ball forward amidst the referee issues seemingly a yellow card Oh no, it wasn't. <laughs> I was just about to be like, guys, what do I not know? <laughs> My apologies, guys. Ventuk High School playing there on Ventuk Gymnasium defense. Let's see if they can turn defense into attack. Ventuk High School keeps the ball. Ventuk Gymnasium intercepts and they follow through their interception until Ventuk High School has other plans for them. Ventuk Gymnasium plays forward. Nice long shot there and the almighty whistle has spoken. to high school, sends the ball back. Went to gymnasium carrying the ball there. Can they carry it past this kudu? Yes, they can. Let's see if one of those kudus can catch it. But the gymnasium catches their intercept. Can they play it back? Yes, they can play it through. It's caught by a Vantuk Gymnasium player. It's really getting heated out on that field now. Vantuk High School aims for the ball and they intercept successfully. Oh, it's a competition now. <laughs> Vantuk Gymnasium intercepts. Vantuk High School wants their ball back. Vantuk Gymnasium sends the ball on and Vantuk High School almost intercepted, but they weren't able to. And the referee calls the game to a halt. Went to high school, plays off. Sideways playoff from Vantuk High School and they are seemingly hoping to move forward quite rapidly. Vantuk High School number two, I believe that is Caitlin Leff, moved quite a few meters forward until the referee calls it back. The gymnasium takes the ball into their possession. And the Lions are moving it forward. There's a few kudus. Seemingly wanting to take possession of that ball. Oh, beautiful, beautiful intercept there from Vintuk High School. But the ball is out of bounds. Vintuk High School plays off there. Vintuk High School number two, I believe. Again, that's Caitlin Leff. Gymnasium by a very narrow margin intercepted there. Ball out of bounds. Vantic Gymnasium plays off. And there's a dash for that ball. As Ventuk High School takes it into their possession. Can they keep it in their possession? Yes, they can. Ventuk High School number 12, I believe that's Anthea Kutsia, sends that ball off with a lot of power behind it. And the referee calls it back. Ventuk 
currently in the third quarter of this game. Still level at 0-0 zero, zero each for Ventuk High School and Ventuk Gymnasium. Let's see if they can they can do something about it before this game ends. I'd really like to see at least one 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 goal in this game. Ventuk High School number 15 and there we have called for the end of the third quarter of this game. Very very tough play here from both sides. I think, again, as I mentioned in the beginning of this game, a lot of pride at play here. We saw it this morning with a big brag with these two schools. With these two schools, um, again, bragging about their pride to each other. There was a lot of noise being made. There was a lot of pride, a lot of chills, a lot of energy going around in that room. And they've just definitely translated that energy onto the pitch. So we will see if they can continue this energy and turn it into a goal in the final quarter of this game right after this ad break. Adam Tass is coming to Vinduk to help build a brighter future for education. Join us at the Sounds of Caring concert at Vinduk High School Fech Cop on 20 and 21 May where he will be performing with Vaughn Irons and Rian Smith. Tickets cost $200 Namibian dollars and are available via eticket.my.na. All proceeds go towards the African Child Development Trust. Thank you for sticking with us through that ad break we're about to play off. But if hockey is not your type of entertainment, please be sure to join us for Mr. Adam Tass right here in the capital city of Vintuk. And we have a playoff there from Vintuk Gymnasium. Vintuk Gymnasium playing in a zigzag-ish formation. And it seems VRS has caught on to their tactics. Ball out of bounds. If you ask me, a gymnasium playoff. Let's see if, I, if I've got it right here. I have got it right. It is a Ventuk Gymnasium playoff. Ventuk Gymnasium plays off very beautifully, might I add. Ventuk High School trying to intercept. Call from the referee there. Okay, a little huddle there from Vantuk High School. Let's see what they come up with. Penalty there. Let's see what Vantuk High School does with it. As mentioned previously, a playoff there in the into the penalty from Vantuk High School. Seems Ventuk Gymnasium seems eager to stop that ball. Let's see. Ventuk High School sends it back. And the referee calls it. Ventuk Gymnasium plays off. Beautiful moment there between Vintage Gymnasium and Vintage High School. My apologies, guys. I have just received the corrected team list. It seems our team list may have been a little bit off. So if I have misnamed, mislabeled anybody on that pitch, I am so, so, so very sorry. Huddle there from the gymnasium. Let's see what they'll do with this penalty.
Guys, I am. We are in the final quarter of this game. I am at the edge of the of my seat. My mouth is properly watering. I am about ready for at least one goal. Just give me that one flawless, adrenaline-filled moment where they score a goal. Just once, please, guys. Oh, beautiful fall there from the goalie. But the high school moves it forward. Not if any if Ventuk Gymnasium has anything to say about that. And we're gunning for the ball. Ventuk Gymnasium has such a near miss, guys. That is crazy. Ventuk High School has the ball in their possession. Ball out of bounds. Appears to be a Gymnasium playoff. Gymnasium plays off again. A beautiful flick from Gymnasium. Their coach needs to teach me that, please. Went to High School intercepts. Moving towards their territory. Went to Gymnasium tries to send it back. But you know who does send it back? The coach. Ach, the referee. Apologies. Went to Gymnasium takes possession. Let's see if they can keep it. Yes, they can. Carrying it through. But Akudu tries to intercept Vintage Gymnasium and Vintage High School both eagerly gunning for the ball. Referee calls it back. Playoff by Vintage High School. Vintage High School plays off. Beautiful catch there. The Khamis seem to be going for that ball. Let's see if Vintage High School can keep them off their track. Ventuk High School playing it forward, much to the dismay of Ventuk Gymnasium, who are playing hard for that ball. Ventuk Gymnasium tries to intercept, and the referee calls the shots. Ventuk Gymnasium playoff there. Ventuk Gymnasium plays it through, and. A maze of kudus running around on that field. Let's see if Vintic Gymnasium can carry it through. Oh, intercept there by Vintic High School. Vintic High School carries the ball. Number 12 has a near miss there. Vintic High School carries the ball. And the whistle has spoken. Ventuk High School takes possession of the ball. Ventuk Gymnasium trying to fight them for it, and they've won. Ventuk Gymnasium carries the ball forward. Ventuk High School intercepts. Ventuk Gymnasium intercepts right back. And Ventuk Gymnasium trying to carry it through, but the Kudus take it into their hands. Ventuk Gymnasium carrying the ball again. Playoff there from the Blow School. Ventic Gymnasium takes possession of the ball in that blue playoff. Ball out of bounds. Seems to be a Ventic High School playoff. Ventic High School plays off and they carry it through. The referee has spoken. Vintage High School carries the ball forward. Playoff there, seemingly by Vintage Gymnasium, number 12. Thank you. 
Bentuk High School has possession of the ball. Bentuk Gymnasium tries very hard to intercept. Let's see if they can. Oh, yes, they can. But they have to get past those kudus first. Bentuk Gymnasium flawlessly carrying that ball forward amidst competition. Ball out of bounds seems to be a blue ball. Bentuk Gymnasium intercepts. Bentuk Gymnasium gunning for that ball and it's out of bounds. Bentuk Gymnasium playing off. Bentuk Gymnasium number eight starts us off in the last few minutes of this match. Let's hope. One goal. If you want to make this commentator very, very happy, you're going to give a one goal in this game. Penalty there. Let's see what Vintage Gymnasium can achieve. Bentuk Gymnasium has the ball in their possession. And the Kudus go for it. Bentuk Gymnasium keeps the ball in their possession. Went to high school, throws off that ball. Yeah. Let's see that beautiful support if you caught that moment. Beautiful support from both side, uh, sides as the Vendok High School crowd cheers for their beloved blowers and those beautiful black, red and white balloons. They're outside the pitch as the Vendok Gymnasium mascot seems to be marching around to get a better view of this play. Ball out of bounds. Bentuk Gymnasium play, ball out of bounds. Bentuk High School plays off. And we have roughly three more minutes left in this gameplay. I know it's not likely, but my heart still hopes for one goal. Goals are rare in this sport, and that's what makes them so much more beautiful. That ma that's what makes us treasure it so much more. Let's see if one of these teams can make me happy. I'll buy a chocolate for the team captain. And the blowers take possession. Oh, tumble there from Vendok High School.
Mantuk High School plays off. Mantuk High School almost carries through their playoff. Mantuk Gymnasium trying very hard to make a difference in the score there. Let's see if they can. They have about two minutes left to do so. Mantuk High School number seven plays off from, uh, from the boundary line. Referee calls the game play back there. We have one minute and 10 seconds, T minus and counting. Please give me a score. I'm changing, I'm changing my, my, my previous statement, my previous chocolate related statement. I'll buy a chocolate for every member of the team if they just give me one, one, one goal. Penalty shootout by Vendek High School. Players eagerly waiting. Let's see what they can achieve. One minute on the clock, roughly. Vendek Gymnasium intercepts and the ball is in play in the hands of Vendek Gymnasium. Beautiful flick again. And with that, the game comes to an end. Ventuk Gymnasium versus Ventuk High School girls, ages 16 to 18. Draw at 0-0 zero, zero each. Very, very beautiful, picturesque, picture-perfect game there. From the tunneling to the flicking, absolutely gorgeous gameplay there. Beautiful to watch. Um, I think not beautiful to play. They seem quite tired. Um, but from my side, absolutely beautiful to watch, beautiful tunneling, beautiful flicking, um, beautiful camaraderie, beautiful sportsmanship, the boys warming up there on the team. So stay with us. We'll be right back with the Ventic Gymnasium versus high school first boys teams. But first, I must say a very, very, very big congratulations to both of those teams. Again, this has been such an absolute pleasure of a game to watch. Um, yeah, we'll see you in a bit with the Ventuk Gymnasium versus Ventuk High School first boys teams. We'll be right back. Adam Tass is coming to Vinduk to help build a brighter future for education. Join us at the Sounds of Caring concert at Vinduk High School Fek Cop on 20 and 21 May where he will be performing with Vaughn Irons and Rian Smith. Tickets cost 200 Namibian dollars and are available via eticket.my.na. All proceeds go towards the African Child Development Trust.
Okay, just it's uh, time for the big game. I suppose you guys have been waiting, uh, obviously, a long time. It's uh, this is a nice uh, setup, and the Inter High is also always a big tournament and uh, or a big game. You guys ready for that one? Yes, we're very excited for the game. We've been preparing now for months, gone to other tournaments, everything, and I think we're ready for the game tonight. Yeah, and the preparations in that tournament, are uh, you happy with that? Uh, could you address all the things that you needed to? Yes, um, we could. Yeah. And uh, what uh, do you know? What do you know about uh, Vintuk uh, Gymnasium and their, their team? I know they went to, I think they went to Cape as well for a tournament. Uh, seems like they did well. Played in the final against Paul Gymnasium. Um, so um, they quite a competitive team. Yes, I know they are a very strong team. But I know today we're going to give them a run. Yeah. Okay. And the preparations in the week leading up. Uh, happy with that? Yes. Okay. Been working hard. Great. Enjoy it, eh? Thank okay. you. Thanks. Okay. And back to the studio.